Hello everyone, how's it going? Doctor Incompetent here, and let's play some Into the Inferno, shall we? Picking up where we left off, and we need to level up if we're going to get anywhere, because the enemies are too strong, and I am not. I need money, I need a dream, I need it all to happen. So I'm going to kind of try to stay close to the town and fight some of the riffraff here. See if they can help us get stronger without uh, killing us. That would be good. I'm just going to kind of map out some territory. I always like doing this in games, like you can see in the upper right, the mini-map. Just filling it in while I go around looking for trouble. Now, this is the other zone here, but we're going to avoid that for the moment. I don't think I'm ready to upgrade the threats. And here's six insects. Okay. So, um, oh, cool. Uh, it looks like the developer has added the combat log uh, that I was looking for. That is fantastic. So, let's see how this plays out. Uh, I'm going to... Maria, what can you cast? Nothing. So just hit it. And then Ava, you're the mercenary. Just hit it. And then Adriana, can you cast anything? Uh, no, just hit him. And then my favorite spell so far, like sleep has just been a real MVP. And all right. So we kill one insect. And you can see... Okay, here we go. Here's our targets and what's going on with them. And here's our hit point loss. So a lot of them are asleep. Now we can look at the combat log, which is, I love this. Okay, so I'm really glad that this was added. So we can just go back and read what happened. So um, we got missed, we got hit for two, we got hit for three, and then we got hit for one. So nothing massive. And we killed one of them. So we know that this one is dead because there's a skull. Let me attack, attack, attack. And we're just gonna attack with everybody. Okay, we got we killed one. All right, we killed three. We killed four. Okay, great. And did they attack us? I woke up. I woke it up, but I don't know if it got to attack. Yeah, it hit us for two. That's fine. The party has won the battle. Sweet. Okay, we got it. So we get 27 experience and a gold. Um, and Maria gained a level. Fantastic. She gained strength. Ava gained a level. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Level two, baby. Charisma. Adriana's up. You see, we got way more hit points. Wisdom. Doctor Incompetent also went up a level. Got some charisma. Phenomenal. Okay. Um, I'm going to save the game really fast just because we did level up. Uh, I'm okay on health. Maria is a little bit hurt, so we could go um, to Adriana and cast Minor Healing um, on Maria, and she's back up. There we go. Now I feel a little bit more comfortable. Okay, five goblins. This is challenging, but I think we can do it. Um, our MP is super high, so we attack, attack. And did, did you get new spells, or do I have to go into town to learn those? I'm going to check the manual. Um, we're going to go ahead and cast... Uh, sleep on these dudes and let's go Alright, they're attacking us first and they're hitting us pretty hard I don't like that at all So the goblins are quite quicker uh, Quite faster I should say than the previous enemies now uh, we killed one Killed two woke the guy up you know, I think it's a big mistake on my part to attack with the wizard. I'm trying to be very conservative with my magic points. But I think it's dumb. Um, we're going to go ahead and attack. Is anybody near death? Maria has taken a good bit of damage, but I'm just going to attack. At this point, though, there's a sleeping one and a you know vaguely injured one. It's yellow at health, so let's just keep attacking. All right, chill one. Bah! Alright, we didn't do a good job attacking right there. 
Okay, there we go. We got him. So this is a big battle for us, I believe. Yeah, 37 experience and 7 gold. And, ooh, we found some robes. Let me look at that. What is the? What are these robes that we have found? Item robes. Um, now, in terms of what she's wearing on her body, nothing. So, um, I'm going to actually just say uh, equip number one. And their robes, now, um, armor class, remove one. Oh, uh, equip one, remove um, slot number 13. So you can see these do benefit my armor class by one, these robes. So I don't know what they are, but I think they might just be unidentified, but they're working. Okay, so at this point, what I'm going to do is go to Adriana, and we're going to cast healing and top people off so we can try to make it back to town. Um, everybody, like, we're missing five, we're missing five. I think this is okay, but I'm going to be careful, and I'm going to cast healing on Adriana, because she's just so fragile, and if she goes, um, we're in bad shape. All right, so let's go home. Back to the town, anyway. Mm-hmm, hmm uh, I'm going to just kind of map out this little strip if I can four spiders no problem attack 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 and then I'm gonna actually just cast magic arrow and see what this does for us all right we did get back neck knocked around but we killed two of them and one of them is critical now let me look at the log here so one Two. Ah, we took like three damage. It's not a problem. I'm just going to attack across the board. Alright, cool. We did get hit again, which stinks. But they hit Adriana, which is... I'm glad we healed. Alright, 30 experience and a gold. Alright, tremendous. Let me see where we at. Um, for the next level, we need about 300. Okay, no problem. So if I go here and I pool our money, we're up to 84 gold, which is pretty good. I don't think I actually even need to... Don't you... Res do you restore magic points sometimes on walking, or is that only if you're well-rested? I can't remember how that works. Yeah, you do restore. You restore hit points and magic points while walking, which is phenomenal. Um, so I don't necessarily need to go back to the inn or something to recover that unless I want to do it more precipitously, but I think this is okay. All right, then let's just... Um, I'm going to save it, and we're going to keep fighting. All right, there's one centipede, so this is just everybody attacks. Okay, this is actually didn't work out as well as I thought. So we're going to attack it, but then I'll use um, Magic Arrow. Maybe it has hard armor and we need to, like, um, or not. Got it. Party has won the battle. I really love that we regenerate slowly when walking around. It's just such a um, nice thing to have happen. I'm just going to do this to kind of map this out. Um, five bugs. Okay. So, uh, wait, wait. Previous, previous, previous. Did I attack with you? Attack, attack, attack. And we will just put him to sleep. Oh, man. I love when he gets to go first with the sleep. That's such good CC. Okay, so at this point, there's two dead, two asleep, and one injured. So we're just going to attack. Uh, I'll attack. Wow, they had like no hit points. Doctor Incompetent killed. 
All right. Yeah, they don't give you money, but 22 experience is fine. Easy fight. All right, I'm going to continue mapping it out. Mm-hmm. I don't want to go to the next zone. I'm just exploring the current zone. And honestly, everybody is like very, very nice on hit points. Magic points aren't where I want them to be. So maybe I do need to go back to replenish them. Maybe they stop recovering at a certain point. Oh, we picked up some clothes. Okay. Um, equip... What's your armor class? One? Oh no, you already had padded armor on. Does anybody not have anything on the body? Oh, maybe I already had clothes. Not sure, but we don't need them. Padded armor is better. Alright, I definitely need to go in someplace to get my MP back. It's not recovering at the rate that it once was. So we're going to cast a Magic Arrow on these guys. Alright. Um... Hit Doctor and Comfort too. That's not nice. Just a full attack. All right, we got him. That was actually tougher than I thought. Okay, we're going back in town. All right, so we're in the town, and I was looking at the manual, which is a smart thing to do. And there is a bunch of good stuff in here. One of the things I saw was that Ava um, is able to actually identify stuff because certain classes can identify, certain rogue-type classes. So rogues, mercenaries, and tricksters can all identify. So somebody, like these clothes, for example... Um, oops, I went to the wrong person. Uh, here we go. So I want to trade item one with Ava. And then, does anybody... Somebody had something that was... Yeah, these robes. Um, well, let's go to Ava really fast and identify these clothes. Um, she develops a headache. So I think that means she didn't identify them. So she tried. Oh, it lowered my intelligence to one. Now, I didn't realize this. Temporary. Okay. Um... Okay, so it makes it becomes harder to identify an item if you have a headache. Ouch. Okay, so let's watch out for that. Alright, so something I want to do is just restore my mana. So this... Let me see if I can remember where the uh, places to restore mana are. I think this is um, the village... This is the quest, the village elder. One of these, I feel like, is the sleeping dog in... Um, we could save the game here. I mean, that's always good. The well. Uh, I think this little onk means magical. Let me see here. Ah. This is the cursed items place, not the uh, mana restore place. Right, right, right. Alright, let's look around for... What about this place over here? What's this? Oh, no, okay. What's this? The tailor. Alright, leave. So the bag icon appears to be shops. No, no, no. 
I think this is the mana place back around here. It is. Um, so, cost 17 gold. So, pool the gold, pay the fee. Okay, great. So, we got our mana back. So, now we can go back out into the wild and just give him heck. We're here to level up, get stronger, make the dream a reality. Okay. Um, let's see. All right, insects, great. Attack. By the way, you can push A to attack. Like, uh, usually the hotkeys are the first letter of what you're trying to do. So attack, attack, and I'm going to cast. I'm going to cast sleep on the insects. Great, we acted first, which means we'll just put them down. Take a snooze. Now right, we got two dead, three dead. That's great. Tack, tack, tack. Dude, that was awesome. That was a complete victory. That was a kill. No loss of anything. So, uh, let's see over here. Um, uh huh. Ah, here we go. So, here's my overview map. Uh, we want to go probably down here. That looks good. Two cobalts. Okay. Attack. 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 That's a good that's a good job there. Love it. We took one damage. We get a bunch of experience for everybody and some gold. Ooh, we found a sword. Okay, cool. So let me see um Ava. Her intelligence is not back yet, so let's just let her have some time to chill. Mm-hmm. Alright. So, over here, I am going to save the game. And then just explore, like, goblin warriors are guarding the village. Alright. So, there's some guys over here. I can only imagine that the Goblin Warriors are guarding the village. Of course they are. Alright, um, attack the Goblin Warriors. Oh, there's two groups. Oh, dear. This is less than ideal. Alright, I'm actually going to cast Sleep on the second group of Goblin Warriors. All right, so we did not do a good job right there. Oh. All right, we have a dead person. Okay, so I'm going to run. This is bad. This is why I saved it. I was just kind of testing this out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, quit to the menu. And we're going to load 
this game and just turn around. So I wanted to feel it out. How close are we? Honestly, we just don't do enough damage to kill them fast enough. Like if we could do a little bit more damage, we'd you know, be in much better shape, but we're not there. So let's just go back and try to get some money. We need to get people better equipment, better armor, and better weapons. And I think, you know, being a higher level would be tremendous. So let's just try to do that. You know, another fun thing is, can I... Let's see, I haven't tried to fight this dude since I was, you know... Uh, okay. Level 1, so maybe... So these are just hard to hit, but they're not hard. Got it. You're darn right we won. That's what we do. We win. Alright. Um, the Grizzled Fisher. Okay. So I'm going to attack this guy. Attack. Cast. Uh, cancel. We don't really need that. Just attack, and then... Why don't you cast... Strength on Maria? He already killed Maria. Okay. So the problem is with this guy, he just hit us too many times for too much damage. I'm just attacking him. We're going to kill you, buddy. One of these days. We didn't kill you. The party has lost a battle. Indeed, we have. All right, let's go ahead and try it again. All right, that guy is still too. That fisher is like... No wonder he is so close to the town and just doesn't care. Oh, okay. So if you save your game in the inn, it does give you the rested state, which boosts your regeneration. So we should do that, and then... Oh, the headache has worn off. Great. So I think... Who got the sword? Right. So, um... Trade item one with... Ava, and then Ava, um, identify two. It's a broadsword. Okay, cool. And her intelligence is still good. Identify the clothes. Okay, that didn't help. So we won't do it again. Now, let me just check. Um, she's got an axe. Um, broadsword there. All right, well, that's probably something we could sell. Alright, we got bugs. We're just gonna all out attack. Just all out attack the bugs. Take that. Alright, um. Just gonna walk around here. Looking for that secret treasure chest. We didn't find it yet, but we will. How close are we on experience? We're actually getting there. Need about 200. Or more like 162, but you know what I mean. Oh boy, this is a lot of guys. Okay, so we need to actually put them to sleep. All right, great. We killed one. Killed two. Now, two damage killed it, so I think we can just all out attack. Maybe I was overreacting. I was. So we each person got 30, though. That's awesome. We'll just all attack these guys.
Uh, let me look at our hit points. Good. Yeah, we just missed. They're hard to hit. Got it. Absolutely trashed them. Okay, we're almost there. <laughs> now, I'm just mapping things out, but trust me, fisherman, I am not coming into your area. You could keep fishing. Your license is being renewed as we speak. Fish away, but I'll be back when I get stronger. I'm going to keep testing myself against you, and one day I'm going to win that fight. You'll feel it. Take this, Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. All right. Got him. They are dead. All right, so I'm just going to keep on mapping it up, uncovering it, feeling real good. Got it. 18 experience. It's great. Mm-hmm. -hmm. Hey, headache's gone. We could try again to identify those clothes. I'm in the graveyard. Yeah, we did about two fights of good size to get up a level. How much money do I have? 103? Is that right? Yeah. All right. It's not great, but we could probably buy some armor. I think we definitely want to invest Maria in armor that's better than the padded armor that she's got. All right. Giant beetle. Alright. No, we need like a good fight here. One centipede? Well, that's okay. 
So you get new spells at level three, it looks like. Uh, that'll also be helpful. You know what? We don't even have the rested status necessarily. Maybe because I went into town, but our um, all of our MP and stuff is back, so that's phenomenal. So at level three, our mage is going to get acid arrow, fire arrow, resist magic, and sparks. And it um, sparks is five mana, but it does damage to the whole group of enemies which is absolutely awesome I think this will give us up a level um, okay we did not win so what we're going to do um, is go here and uh I'll try to cast Magic Arrow. Uh, we got one of them dead. There you go. These guys are just nimble. Did it. Killed them. Oh, we are so close. Yes, we did it. Leveled up. Level 3, baby. Intelligence. Ava got up to level. Constitution. Look at our hit points. Adriana got up a level... There we go. Look at all the magic points. The hit points went up a level. Perfect. Okay. We also found a spear. Um, Alright, so trade the spear with Ava. It's a pike. So it says in the manual that um, weapons... You won't know how much damage they do unless you use it in battle. So... Um, you know, if I want to equip three, I can use it with a shield. So I'm going to try it. Can you identify uh, the clothes? Man, these clothes are really challenging for us. But look at what we got. I'm going to just kind of head back to town. We're level three. This is a big deal. Um, do you have any spells? No. But we can pretend like we do. One day we'll get we'll get spells. Usually if it's like a D&D &D thing, paladins don't get spells until they're much higher level like to even get first level cleric spells, so we'll see. But everyone, I'm super pumped because now we're level 3, which means that we can uh, cast some better spells and that should at the very least allow us just to level up and make money faster. And we're going to keep going with gearing up our crew and then seeing if we can move over and take out the goblins, etc. Um, this is the healing place if we want, but we don't want to pay that fee. We can't. All right, everybody. Oh, there's a bug. I forgot. There's a bug in the town. Let's get it. I hope you're enjoying this series like I am, and I will check you guys in the next episode when we try to keep gearing up and move over and try to save the kidnapped villagers. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.